far as we are concerned, we cannot fail to get 111 when you have 122 members of parliament sitting in the chamber. We were very confident and we are still very confident. It's a girl, Lama Tams, also known as Galopa said, go from Zambia. If you're new to my YouTube channel, please subscribe so that each time I upload a video, in this you'll video, be I'll be sharing with you about the Tutwa Ngolobe. Thank you. Now, Tutwa Ngolobe so is a prominent a lawyer in Zambia that is now, the member of parliament Sana. of Kawe and had argued that Bill 10. Uh, was disrupted because of UPND members um, that had bribed, according to him, bribed um, PF members and had also tempered with the computer system. Now, thank God for um, the judge, uh, Mr. Speaker. We log in, we log in just before voting, and everyone logged in. There's no dispute about that. Whoever was present. Whoever was present. Mm -hmm. But when we voted, the system shows that some people were not present. The system shows that some people are not even available. The system shows that five nominated ministers were not present when they were. So... For the system to generate a report which shows that there were only three nominated members of parliament when they are aware, all the eight seated in the chamber. When they are aware, more than nine independents. So I can even give you a, a rough count. 83, 83 plus, 83 plus eight. Okay. That's giving us what? 91. 91 plus, uh, plus nine. Okay, that's giving us uh, 100. Plus five. That's 105. Plus six. Uh, 111 plus 4 mmd uh, that's 115 plus uh, fdd that's 116 plus um, chifubu okay that's 117 plus uh, wusakile that's 118 plus mansabombwe that's 119 yeah so roughly roughly we should have been about 119 votes so you, you as uh, you and honorable uh, mundu uh, is the chief whip government chief whip and you as the deputy chief whip, you had done your homework. Everything was said, and that's okay. why we told you that we had the numbers. Okay. We had the numbers, and we still have the numbers. If we have to go back for a rerun, bill number 10 will go through. Okay. If the system is not tempered with, to show, for example, that the PF were 84, when we were not 84, we were 83. Right? So, the, that shows you, that shows you, that uh, somebody tempered with the system to make sure that bill number 10 does not go through. Okay, so are you, as a party, I know you have the party in power, I, are you willing to hold an official inquiry or you shall treat this as water? And this, is, this, is, mm -hmm. this is a very serious matter. Mm -hmm. uh, there was a point of order raised by Honorable Member of Parliament for, for Chifugu. And I think a lot of letters have been written to Mr. Speaker's office. He's reserved the matter for ruling. Okay. So we are hoping all these irregularities could be addressed. Because as far as we are concerned, we cannot fail to get 111 when you have 122 members of parliament sitting mm -hmm. in the chamber. We were very confident and we are still very confident. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> Nafuti wa shuta biuteni ya ini? Yeah. But whether now wa shuta biuteni, tuwefu wa kubewa wa kubewa ti 2021 yuena tawa kapite. Yeah. Okay, so you have listened to the, 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 the,
on merit. Uh, this is what happens. People don't want to accept their fate. And Bill 10 was evil. And I'm so happy that it didn't go through. And um, the speaker just told him off and put him to order. Listen to what he has to say. Honorable members, in view of the foregoing, it is evident that for a member to vote, they need to first log into the board system. Thereafter, they must select, select the present key to signify their intention to vote. Where a member only logs into the system, but does not select the present key, they will not be able to vote. Thus the system will capture the member as present for purposes of logging in and not present for purposes of voting. Honorable members, as regards Dr. F. Nandi MP, and Mr. K. Kawaso MP, the report indicates as follows. Participant name, Dr. F. Frank Ngambi, group, PF, voting answer, not present, attendance, present. Two, Mr. Kampampi Kawaso. Group PF, voting answer, not present. Attendance, present. Honorable members, in the column headed attendance, both Dr. F. Ngambi MP and Mr. K. Kawaso MP are indicated as being present. This means that both honorable members successfully logged into the system for purposes of voting. In the second column, headed voting answer, both honorable members are indicated has not been present. This signifies that both Dr. F. Ngand MP and Mr. Kekawaso MP did not select the present key which would have activated the voting options and enabled them to vote. Honorable members, in his point of order, Dr. F. Nand MP alleged that his vote could not be registered because his council froze. However, Investigations have revealed that if he indeed is consul froze, as alleged, he would not even have been able to log into the system, let alone to press the present and yes options, as alleged in his, in his letter of complaint. At any rate, if his consul had indeed frozen, as alleged, he should have immediately alerted me and I would have in turn instructed the ICT officers in the chamber to assist him forthwith. As a matter of fact, an ICT specialist is positioned adjacent to me. This gentleman here. In the premise, I've come to the conclusion that on the material day, Dr. F. Nandi MP logged into the system as required. He, however, did not select the present key, which would have been activated the necessary options to enable him to vote. Therefore, contrary to his assertion that his vote was not recorded due to a system 
failure, Dr. F. Ngambi's failure to register his vote was as a result of his own failure to press on present and thereby register his intention to vote and subsequently indeed proceed to vote. Honorable members, so thanks for watching my YouTube channel. I'll see you on my next video. I love you guys.